In this court, all men are equal. You have heard those words many times before. All men are equal. But what about all women? Are women the equal of men? There are those who tell us that they are. Last week, an auspicious meeting of women was held in Kalamazoo. The meeting was addressed by a very prominent lady who is noted for her modesty. She is so modest that she blindfolds herself when taking a bath. Modesty runs in her family. She has a nephew who's just 10 years of age, and sometimes the nephew says, I'm going to the Forbidden Name store. The little fellow is too modest to say, I'm going to the A and P. Well, here's what that modest lady said to the gathering of women in Kalamazoo. My sisters, the time has come when we must stand up and declare ourselves. For too long have we been trodden under the feet of men. For too long have we been treated as second-class citizens by men who say that we are only good for cooking their meals, mending their socks, and raising their babies. You have a boyfriend, and he calls you his queen. Then when he marries you, he crowns you. These are the sort of men who when they become romantic, or I should say, when they are in a certain mood, they want to kiss you and kiss you and kiss you again. My sisters, put your faces against it. And if a man takes from you without your permission, look him squarely in the face, roll your eyes at him, and say to him, how dare you, you male chauvinist pig! You put that kiss right back where you got it from! My sisters, we in, are in bondage and we need to be liberated. Liberation is our cry. Just yesterday, I talked with a woman who is the mother of 15 children. And she said, yes! I want to be liberated from the bedroom. And so are my sisters. The time has come when we must let this male chauvinist understand that the hand that changes the diapers is a hand that shall rule the world. And now, my sisters, let us stand and sing our national song. For Billy, for the few who have not yet memorized the words, here they are. The woman's day is drawing near. It's written in the stars. The fall of men is very near. Proclaim it from the, your cars. Sisters, rise. Your flags unfurl. Don't be a little girl. Say down with men. Their power must end. Women shall rule the world. Thank you. Would, would it, would it get, would it get some, 
Would it get some wind? Would it get some wind for? Would it get some wind for the? Would it get some wind for the sailboat? <laughs> 